Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are doing well. In today's video, we are gonna be looking at another objective player. But this is from the mixed league team of the season. You know, the whole uh, thing that is going on in FC Mobile. I mean, FC24 right now, my bad. Uh, so we are gonna be looking at none other than Tots plus Dusan Tharic. I hope I didn't butcher his name, but that was exciting to say. So we are going to be looking at this very card now. I know because of EA servers, certain things don't load. We all know that problem. But yeah, this is the wonderful card that we are going to be looking at. He has four star skill move, four star weak foot, and we are going to be using him in a game. Once we collect all the you know sub objectives that are yet to be collected, I have completed this whole objective. Don't worry, I'm not going to waste your time by sitting and doing each and everything right now. But we are going to be looking at the card. We are going to be looking at the stats, and we'll put him in game in a team and then we'll try him out and see how he actually is in his preferred position now i will most probably use him at right wing because i already have uh, a first team left winger so i don't think he'll be in my left wing even if he's like coming into my first uh, starting 11 but we're going to be trying out him in a game and seeing if his stats are really good or if it's underrated or if it's overrated so let's get started first off four star skill move four star weak foot which is actually pretty decent for a free card that we are going to be getting so i'm not going to complain about it i don't really care about the weak foot and skill i mean i care about the weak foot a little bit but skill move i don't really care so four star weak foot not bad actually his preferred foot is left so from right wing even if i use him if I use Trivella, which I think is one of his playstyle pluses, if I'm not wrong. Yeah, he has Trivella plus, which is one of his playstyle plus, uh, along with Flare plus and Technical plus. He has three playstyle pluses. So I think it will be decent, you know, left four star weak foot, which is going to be his right foot. And preferred foot is left. I think it will be really good. So, and next thing is his positions he can be played at four different positions preferred position left wing and alternate positions are right wing center forward and left mid so this is a really exciting card uh, he is more attacking oriented because as you guys can see on the stats it says he has only 51 defense uh, not like the other card that we did which was Nicol Nicholas Beste he had around 80 something for defense and I have actually done an evolution on him i've sent him from 90 to 91 which actually gives him like a decent decent uh, stats so i will show you guys that card as well so yeah this is from super league is that how you pronounce that league super league uh Fernbashe. i think that's how you pronounce his, that team's name right i don't know i might have butchered it i might be going somewhere wild so yeah feel free to correct me guys and looking at his stats his attributes details 90 pace 93 shooting 91 dribbling for a left finger i think that is pretty decent main thing for a left finger is his crossing and his curve and his passing he has 90 short pass he has 85 long pass he has 90 curve and he has 91 crossing i think that is actually pretty cool i don't know how many of you guys are going to be passing with a winger i usually don't i just try to score from outside the box because it's more fun to watch uh, the ball going from outside the box into the goal it is more fun so I am most concentrated on his shooting, which has 88 short path, 90 long shots. He has 98 penalties, you know, that is actually pretty cool. He has 95 finishing as well. And he has 91 acceleration and 89 spin speed. Pace is one thing that is worrying about a left winger. If he had like 93, 94, it'll be really good. But um, it's it's good. It's pretty decent. We can apply some chemistry styles because he's a tots plus card he's gonna have full cam anyway so play, applying a chemistry style is just gonna boost his stats and looking at dribbling he has 90 dribbling only is that good enough i don't know we'll look at that when we play with him in the team and he has 98 stamina which is something really nice because i i love stamina i just love using one player from start to end so yeah 98 stamina is pretty good as well now what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna show you guys what you have to complete to get this card and you can actually complete this like within i guess two hours just like the previous one guys this is very simple and very easy to complete you just have to play nine games just just think of that you just have to play nine games with three players from that league and then while playing those nine games just have two players from serbia and then get six assists and score i think six goals or seven goals 
you need to score five goals my bad you need to score five goals with a finish shot you need to get six assists there's no through ball nothing like that just six assists you need to win six games with two servants and you need to play nine games with players from the same league i don't know how to pronounce that league but you need to have three players from that league so basically nine games you have to play and you will be able to score finish shots and that's how most people score you'll be able to give assists like that's just hap- going to happen and then six wins if you're playing squad battles literally it'll be done in no time so yeah uh, let us just collect all this collect the card and put him in a squad I'll show you guys the squad that I'm using so and then we'll go and start a game. Now I am not going to be applying any chemistry style to him. He has only two chemistries. I mean he has only plus two chemistry so I'm not going to be applying anything. We'll just play with the raw card and see how actually good he might be in game. So yeah, we'll check out his dribbling, we'll check out his speed, we'll check out his shooting from outside the box, his curve, his crossing, you know, all these basic stuff to come to a conclusion on how the player is i think the objective is pretty decent guys as an objective card as a free for all card i think it's pretty cool but as a player how he is can you use him in game we'll do that he feels a bit slow off the bat you know like i feel like his acceleration is still a bit slow he has decent dribbling uh it is a bit weird to control him that might be just my weird broken controller acting up but i need to actually sit in you know outside the box his shooting is a bit weak guys actually i don't know i don't know if this card is good enough to be used as of now first impression is not that great he's a bit slow is the shot is not coming off at a rapid speed his space is also space is actually not bad but i think there are better cards his crossing is actually pretty decent he has a bit of a good cross on him but uh, shooting is not up, like up to my liking at least he has a pretty decent header on him you guys saw that so we need to if we get a corner i'll try using him in a uh, you know uh, try to take a corner with him Okay, Tad is just here, so I'm gonna try to, you know, dribble past and take the ball and kind of judge his speed as well. His, his shooting is super weak, guys. For a left finger, his shooting is super weak. I can actually get behind his dribbling and pace also, but his shooting is so weak. Why is it so weak? He had like 89 sh- shot per or something. 89 shot per is supposed to be pretty decent. I think I think you guys are better off using Nicholas Beste. You guys will enjoy using him as well. He has he has a good good amount of speed on him. His dribbling is really good as well. And if you guys do the free evolution that is there for everybody, you guys can boost him to another level. And I'm pretty sure you guys will score a ton of goals from outside the box and you'll enjoy it so yeah verdict i don't know if this card is worth it guys like it's a decent grind but yeah wow finally we score a goal with him finally we score a goal with him but yeah this 93 shooting i don't think it is uh, up to the stats i think it is a bit overrated uh the stats are a bit overrated I think maybe like he should have 88 shooting instead of 93 because we have used him so far we have just got one goal out of him. See look at this player Kowalski or somebody I don't know who it is. I just used him he had a better shot than Tadic so far so I would definitely say he should have at least like he should have maximum like 89 shooting maybe but yeah. Uh, that is one overrated stat but apart from that the card is okay i wouldn't say you should play with him but he's okay so yeah hope you guys enjoyed this player review this was a weird one yeah i'll see you guys in the next one guys take care stay safe stay motivated and keep moving bye bye